Welcome to another video from Guitar School Live. In this video, I'll show you how to set up the MVAVE Chocolate MIDI Foot Controller to control your old DSP plugins in Reaper. Let's get started. To begin, you'll need to download the Cube Suite Editor to your desktop from the QVAVE website. Go to the link in the description and follow the download instructions. Installation is simple, so there is no need to cover it in this video. In order to control neural DSP plugins in Reaper, we'll use a combination of long and short presses. We'll use long presses to change presets and short presses to toggle effects. Let's begin programming the chocolate controller in the Cube Suite editor. When you launch the Cube Suite program on your desktop, you'll be presented with this screen. To set up the chocolate to control neural DSP plugins, go to the Mode Selection tab and select Advanced Custom Mode. Next, click Foot Switch A and select Step Short or Step Long. You'll see a second box open labeled Bank B. When you step on a pedal, whatever you program in Bank A will be executed when you step on the pedal and release it. Whatever you program in Bank B will be executed when you step on the pedal and hold it. Let's begin by setting up Pedal A. Go to Bank A, double click the entry and select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select CC. For data 1, we'll enter CC number 1. And for data 2, we'll enter 127 as the value. Now go to Bank B and double click the entry. If Bank B is empty, click the Add button. Double click the entry and select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select PC. For data 1, we'll enter number 0. Next, we'll set up Pedal B. Select Step Short or Step Long. Go to Bank A, double-click the entry, and select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select CC. For Data 1, we'll enter CC number 2. And for Data 2, we'll enter 127 as the value. Now go to Bank B and double-click the entry. select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select PC. For data 1, we'll enter number 1. Now click foot switch C. Select step short or step long. Go to bank A, double click the entry and select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select CC. For data 1, we'll enter CC number 3. And for data 2, we'll enter 127 as the value. Now go to Bank B and double-click the entry. Select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select PC. For data 1, we'll enter number 2. Finally, click Foot Switch D. Select Step Short or Step Long. Go to Bank A. Double-click the entry and select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select CC. For data 1, we'll enter CC number 4. And for data 2, we'll enter 127 as the value. Now go to Bank B and double-click the entry. Select your MIDI channel. For MIDI type, select PC. For data 1, we'll enter number 3. To set up the expression pedal, select expression pedal and click interface. Click add. Double click the entry and select your MIDI channel. Enter 11 for data. The loosened value is the value of the pedal when it is fully open. Enter 127. The step on value is the value of the pedal when it is fully closed. Enter 0. Click OK. 
Close the interface and exit the editor. You're now done programming the controller. Let's set up Reaper. Before we begin, we must first set Reaper to respond to messages from the Chocolate MIDI controller. Go to Options. Preference and select MIDI devices. Choose USB MIDI and enable it. Click Apply and OK. Now we're ready to set up Reaper. Setting up the MVave Chocolate Controller to change the Neural DSP presets in Reaper can be done in five easy steps. 1. Add two tracks to Reaper and insert a Neural DSP plugin into the FX bin of track 1 and re-emit a control into the FX bin of track 2. 2. Select USB MIDI from the drop-down menu in track 2. Then drag the routing from track 2 to the routing icon on track 1 and arm track 2. 3. Go to the plugin and choose your desired presets and click Save Preset. For the tutorial, we'll save 4 presets named 1 through 4, but you can name them whatever you wish. Note, the presets you select will automatically be assigned a PC number starting at number 0. Four, click the plus button and select link to MIDI program change and select your MIDI channel. For this tutorial, we're selecting channel one. Five, go to the rear control MIDI setup pane and enable program change. Select load file, click OK for GM rear bank and select general MIDI from the dropdown. Now, when you long step pedals on the chocolate controller, your presets will change. Setting up the chocolate to toggle neural DSP effects in Reaper can be done in three easy steps. 1. Click an effects bypass button. 2. Go to the parameter button. You'll see the effect you just clicked grayed out as last touched. 3. Click learn, step on a pedal on the controller and select toggle from the CC mode drop down menu. Now the effect will toggle. Repeat for the three remaining pedals. To set up the expression pedal, select a control from the plugin. Right click on a parameter and select Enable MIDI Learn. Step on the expression pedal. Right click and select Disable MIDI Learn. Now you'll be able to control the parameter with your expression pedal. Before we end, if you would like to see more videos like this, hit like, then click the subscribe button and ring the bell so you will be notified when new content is released. From all of us at Guitar School Live, we would like to thank you for watching.